the manifestation of the winds of thought is not knowledge. It is the ability to tell right from wrong, beautiful from ugly. What's the purpose of knowledge without judgment? What is the purpose of mind without the ability to discern good from evil? You do not get a pass. None of us do. We are responsible for what we see and what we do. We are responsible for what we allow to be done in our presence without our comment and with our comment. Nazi Germany happened because the German people had enough people, a critical mass of them, who stopped thinking and who let the ideology think for them. You have people waiting in your future, ready to seduce you into their ism, whatever that ism might be. And your own goodness, your own sense of justice, of right and wrong, and of trying to be better than others who went before you is going to lend your credulity to these people. If you do this, if you join into a larger movement dedicated to an ideal, I hope, I pray, that you will not do it with a closed mind. I hope and pray that you will continue to think critically about those things that you care about the most, that you believe in the most. Because if you don't, you risk undergoing the transformation that a cricket does or a grasshopper when it becomes a locust. You risk losing your individuality in service to the mob, a swarm a collective mentality that human beings are prone to join. I hope that you cultivate your own sense of self that is strong enough to resist that. Questions, comments, thoughts? You had one long ago. Questions, comments, thoughts? Okay, I, this is just what I've been thinking about. So. Like, this entire, like, lesson is very good and stuff, but I still, like, think that the German people, none of them were, like, taught the, like, importance of self. So I think, can we, like, blame them for not having... That's a val valid point. Okay. But the answer is, in the face of the six million gone, what is our alternative? If we don't start by criticizing them, we then give ourselves a pass if we go down that road. But you know, your point is extremely well taken. Can you fairly judge someone on standards they don't even know? Thank you. Have a good day. If somebody would turn the lights on, I would appreciate it.